Number 1. Find the number of four letter codes that can be formed when the letter in the word sembunyi if no letters can be repeated. So we see here, four letter codes. So we want to write a code. So when we want to write a code, position is important. So when position is important, we need to use permutation. Alright, no letters can be repeated. Okay, how many of this code starts with a consonant? Okay, so the first one, how many words can be formed? So we have some bunyi, right? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we have say 8 letters and we can see that the letters is not repeating. So every, every letter is different here. So, uh, for just where is the four that I just read just now? Okay, four letter code here. So to choose four letters from the eight letters here, so it will be eight P four. I'm using permutation. Why? Because the uh, position is important because it is a code. So it's important what uh, word is at front or behind. So here eight P four. We get one six eight zero. So we see here how many codes start with consonant. So we see here we want to choose four, right? One, two, three, four. And we have sembunyi here. Oh, I still have to write this. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. So we have this one should start with consonant. And we have five consonant. So since, we, since the first place can only be fulfilled with the consonant, so out of five consonant, so, out of five consonants, there is only one place, right? So, time. So, here we have eight letters. Since one letter is already at front, so now we have seven letters left. So, out of seven letters, there is only there is only three place left. So, here we will get this one is five times Two hundred ten. So here we will get one thousand fifty. All right. To calculate the probability for someone to guess a password of a laptop containing six characters that are selected from all the numbers and alphabet. So numbers we have. 0 up to 9, right? So, 0 up to 9 is 10 numbers because 1 to 9 is 9 and then we have 0 here which is 10 numbers. And then, alphabet, we have 26 alphabet. So, containing 6 characters. So, we see here, the 6 characters is a combination of, the, of these two. So, uh, since we don't know how many alphabet and numbers, so we have we can total up this one. So out of thirty six characters, which consists of numbers and alphabet, so this one is P. Why I'm using P because we are talking about password. So password is very important to know which number comes first. So the position is important, uh, or what comes first is important. That's why we are using permutation. So here out of 36, because 26 plus 10, so it is 6 correct here. So we will get 1402410240. It's quite a large number.